We can call up the Forex pad either via the main menu, New, Forex pad, or using the button in the main menu bar. To insert values into the Forex pad, which we can also do with non-Forex values, for example with shares, we right-click in the field, add instrument, and now we'll add a whole list. So for now, Forex majors, and select, and now all Forex majors pairs are loaded. And if I right-click on an instrument, I can also choose to remove it. And in this way I can personally put my list together how I like it. The order pad also gives us the following information. We can see the selling rate on the left and the buying rate on the right, as well as the high and the low of the day, and the spread which we can spot right here. If we click once on the sell button, then we see that the euro value right there is selected in the order pad as the symbol on the left. The quantity is calculated as taken from the configuration escort. And now we can further define the orders according to our own preferences using the order extras. And we can then activate them either with the cell button or by double clicking on the cell field. And if, on the other hand, we click on Buy, then the button up here is adapted. And once again, we could activate a buy order by clicking once on this button or double-clicking in the buy field.